Hey guys, welcome to your third advanced data structure tutorial. Today we'll be learning deletion in min max heap of min element. Okay, so when n is equal to zero, there is no min element to remove. When n is equal to one, the min max heap becomes empty following the removal of the min element, which is in the root. Okay, so assume that n is greater than one. Now, what is n? Basically, n is the number of levels wise. Okay, so the number of levels is zero. There is no min element to remove. Obviously, when number of levels is equal to one, the min max heap becomes empty following the removal of the min element, which is in the root. So we have to assume that the n is greater than one. Following the removal of the min element, which is in the root, we need to go from one uh, from an n element complete binary tree. To an n minus one element complete binary tree, okay. This causes the element in the position n of the min max heap array to drop out of the min max heap, okay. So here we have min max heap deletion example. This is our original min max heap for our example. We have min level, max level, min level, max level at our root. We have number five, which is the smallest element among the whole original min map min max heap. Okay, then we have thirty and twenty six at max level, which are obviously bigger than the element in the root, which is five. Then again, we have min level where children of thirty are ten and sixteen, which are smaller than their parent. Yes, and twenty and eighteen children of twenty six, which are smaller than their parent also. Of course, yes. Again, we have max level. Here, the children will be bigger than their parent. Twelve and fourteen are bigger than ten. Yes. Twenty-five and twenty-one are bigger than sixteen. Yes. And twenty-two is bigger than twenty. So this is our original min max heap for our example. Now, let's delete the smallest element. That is the root element, which is five. Okay. So our root element is five. We can only delete the smallest element. So step one is what? We delete the element from the root. And we shift the twenty-two, okay, at the position of five over here, so that we can balance the tree. We have to move twenty-two to the root to balance the min-max heap, okay. Now step two, as we know, the smallest element in the min-max heap after the deletion has to be in the root position, okay. No matter whether it is after deletion or before deletion, it has to be the smallest element. Okay, and currently we have ten as the smallest element in the min max heap. Okay, so we perform trickle down operation like this. Okay, now check this tree after deletion, guys. Ten is the smallest number in the whole min max heap. So what do we do is we perform trickle down operation. How we do it? Let's see. Step three is like this. You move ten from here. At its uh, from its original position, and move it at the root position, and then move 22 from here at the position of 10. Okay, now this is called trickle down operation because this is at mean level, and you have to compare only with the mean levels. You don't have to go for the max level. Okay, so after 10, we get to 22 over here. Okay, now what makes the problem is 12 and 14 are at the max level over here. Okay, so what does that mean is twelve and fourteen should be greater than their parent. Okay, but what is the case? Twenty-two is there at the min level, which is their parent of twelve and fourteen, which is greater than twelve and fourteen. Okay, so that's not correct. So what do we have to do is we have to do again trickle down operation. We have to perform it one more time. Okay, and the min max heap will look like this. We replace the twelve over here with twenty-two and twenty-two with 12 over here okay and this is how the final solution will look okay now we'll check if the min max heap is correct or not at the root position we have 10 which is the smallest number in the min max heap yes then at the max level you have 30 and 26 which should be bigger than in its parents that is 10 30 is bigger than 10 yes 26 is bigger than 10 yes again we have a min level where we have 12 and 16 as children of 30 Are twelve and sixteen smaller than thirty? Yes, because thirty is at max level. Yes, twenty and eighteen should be smaller than twenty-six. Yes, they are smaller. Then we have again max level. So children of twelve, twenty-two, and fourteen are bigger than twelve. Yes, 
then 25 and 21 should be bigger than 16 yes they are so this is a proper min max heap and we have got the root element 10 over here after deletion of the min element which was 5 okay so this is how you delete and balance a min max heap by after deletion of the minimum element or smallest element if you like this video then please hit that like button guys if you have any comments or any doubts please ask them in the comment section below please subscribe to the channel for more videos if you want any other explanations please ask me for those videos to be created i'll be more than happy to create those videos for you guys thank you guys for watching this video see you in the next one